Hello Darts Nuts, welcome to Darts Review Channel. In this video I'm going to be checking out one of the accessories that Winmore brought out in their recent 2021 launch. I bought this from totaldarts.co.uk and it's the Winmore Flight Pod. Basically it's a dispenser for your flights. So let's check it out. So it comes in this little box and it says flight dispenser it says spring loaded flight pod holds up to 50 flights cool function design simply pop a flight out okay then so all right so that's the box or the pod i should say and it's got a little key ring so you can attach it to your case or whatever and in the middle it's got a kind of a standard shape spring loaded uh, platform so I've got some flights here uh, these are the Winmore prism now this is a small standard shape so that fits nice and easy this is a, a normal standard number two and that doesn't fit so that's a little bit disappointing isn't it so if you're using normal standards then it's not going to be any good to you uh, here's a pair flight a pair flight will go in here's a slim flight now the slim flight will fit that way it doesn't catch the sides there but it will catch on the back here's a kite so the kite will fit in okay uh, this is a target 10x flight this is a target ghost flight which is just like a kite shape basically a target shard uh, I think they're the vapor s shape so that'll fit in but again it's not holding at the sides so good so I think that's all the shapes I've got uh, these are the small standard harrows see if they'll fit so what i'll do now is i'll see how many flights i can get in right i've just spent i don't know 10 minutes or so filling it up i didn't count the flights i was just trying to get as many in as i can i've got to kite shape pear shaped small standard uh even some of the target 10x flights and the target shard so that's it pretty much full um i can press it down just a little bit and could probably maybe squeeze another flight in there but um i don't think it's very good for storing the slims the slims are a little bit too narrow for the edges but it can get it in on the back but one thing i don't know if you can see is the spring is pushing it up there so it's got this kind of lip around there which is holding the flight but this part of the flights are kind of get, getting pushed up so i don't know whether having them in this for any length of time might distort the shape of the flights it looks as if it possibly could looking at it like that so that is one thing um so i'll just see what happens when i take a flight out so that comes out easy enough over there didn't come out so good so it's not so easy just to get one flight out if they all come out like that but it's definitely kind of warping the, the flights a little bit so let's see there a few came out together there so See now it's getting less tight so they're coming out a little bit easier now. And it's still got the odd one coming out when you don't want it to. But there you go. So how many did I have in? I'll just count them quick. So 
So I actually had 91 flights stuck in there. I mean it, oh what's happened there? Oh, that's great. So now the springs come back. Oh great. But it says only 50 flights in, but obviously I'm testing it. Now how the hell do you fix that now? So after much fiddling, I did get it back on. So be careful if you do get one, don't go like that and push it at an angle because you'll get it stuck inside. So I'm going to put 50 in of the sizes that I think suit it best and then we'll give it a quick bash. Right, so I've put exactly 50 flights in and I've used the kites and the small standards. Um, but as you can see, you still kind of get that kind of raised front half because obviously that side is keeping it tight and the spring is pushing up the front end but if I push it right down you can see there's still plenty of space in there so it will hold more but let's see if it'll come out any easier I think there's probably a knack to getting them out but as you can see, it still brings out the other one underneath. So coming out a little bit better now. But I'm still a little bit wary of it because to me, it kind of looks as if it's going to warp the flights a little. But if you're using the small standards only, I think they're probably the best to use for it. But it's kind of a bit limiting when only a certain flight is going to work but as you can see there I'm pulling them all out again so now even then it's still bringing three out but the small standards certainly fit better Two out again. So I know it's only four pound ninety nine, um, but I don't really think it's working as well as I was hoping it was going to work. So it's a great idea, but I think slightly flawed in the design a little. Uh, but there you go. That's the review of the Winmore flight pod happy darting